Lake Mead, the largest reservoir in the United States, is at its lowest level in history. As of today, the reservoir is at 1,085.6 feet above sea level, which is 155.6 feet below its maximum level of 1,241.2 feet. The low water level is due to a combination of factors, including drought, increased water demand, and climate change. The low water level at Lake Mead is having a number of negative impacts. The reservoir is no longer able to generate as much hydroelectric power, and it is also providing less water for irrigation and drinking water. The low water level is also exposing previously submerged infrastructure, such as old mines and boat ramps. The federal government is working on a number of plans to address the declining water levels at Lake Mead. One plan is to build a new pipeline to transport water from Lake Powell to Lake Mead. Another plan is to increase water conservation efforts in the states that rely on the Colorado River. The low water level at Lake Mead is a serious problem, but it is not insurmountable. With a combination of water conservation and new water supplies, it is possible to ensure that the reservoir remains a vital source of water for the Southwest. The reservoir is currently at 28% of its capacity. The low water level is the result of a 22-year drought. The drought has been exacerbated by climate change. The low water level is having a number of negative impacts.